because I'm still saying, nigga, I don't see what's up. You feel me? I can see the nigga. Ain't. I can see the motherfucker bringing niggas around me. I can see if a nigga bringing the niggas around me was beneficial to both of us. Okay, but then give me the click. Hey, shout off in the bring the people in. Boom, boom. You know what I'm saying? You're going to have some beer. Okay, cool. But not when we doing what we supposed to be doing. I should probably be fun. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to switch up. I'm going to switch up, nigga, because Tyrese coming in a bit. Shit. Got me fucked up. Fuck. Tyreek. Tyreek coming to build and play rap shit. All that shit side to say, up. Oh. Niggas. Oh. Nigga got bad at me. Okay. Okay. I told him, bro, I apologize, man. I'm going to make it up to you. You feel me? I'm going to make it up to you. I'm going to apologize to Tyree. So, bro, say, and he be like, nah, I'm just leaving you up. Because you, sh- you should have walked out of the room with the goddamn six Tyrese placements. I say, you right. But it was like, he was dissing us at the same time. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, that shit was weird. Like he was dissing us at the same time. You feel me? I ain't like that shit. I just seen, I just seen how bro, I, I'm feeding off bro. I was like, this, I know this nigga wanna say something. I'm like, I'm like shit. Hey y'all come so in here like shit. Funny. Oh yeah, Charlie, Charlie gonna tell you. You know, when he did that, then I was like, okay, I got okay. Hit that like button. Come in, hit that like button, man. This shot of red going in on Instagram Live, man, by Jesus, man. Tap in, man. Hit the like button, man. He's like, hit it back. Hey, man, you look. Hey, man, little man. Mm-hmm. Y'all let him have it, man. Y'all let him have it, man. See, I don't trip about You know why I don't trip about shit? I just speak my shit and I be blunt. See, that's different. People don't like, uh, yeah, I love Jermaine. I just don't like how how he uh, handled the venue. So like, even like the same shit you know, I'm talking about now, I, I chump Jermaine off too. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know. We got respect for somebody. You know. 
it's it's a tendency like they get in this place. I'm gonna tell you the real shit. They get in this place where they program to treat everybody the same way, so they don't have no feelings. So it's like when you dealing with a motherfucker, they don't. They've been trained to to uh, treat everybody the same way. Sometimes it takes them a time to come back and be like, man, yeah, I fucked up. You know what I'm saying? They don't get it now. You know what I'm saying? It's like, yeah, 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 yeah. Because they've been trained, like, they, you know, they got them trained. You got to think about it. They got accountants. They got been in team. Like, they tell them, like, they don't schedule. Like, they don't even, they can't even spend their money like they want to spend their money. Bro. You get what I'm saying? Because every time they're trying to have some fun, somebody's stopping them from, from really having fun. Like, you get what I'm saying? So, when, when when you understand that part of like it's somebody that's like telling them like treat everybody the same because once you treat one person you go out you're gonna get them that and i get it i get it you know what i'm saying but ain't nothing in it ain't nothing in the world uh more worth than me being a people person bro. i don't give me a fuck Especially when you believe in the high being, when you believe in something, bro, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm a cheat. I come from nothing. I can't sit here and allow. I'm going to get my last. If anybody know me, shit, nigga, I, you might not know I ain't got it, but shit, nigga, I'm, I'm going to get I'm going to get to You know what I'm saying? Because I'm not going to move like that. I'm not, I'm not going to move like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm not finna move like this. Like, I'm not finna let nobody take my humanity away from me. You feel me? And that's the thing. I'm not finna let nobody take my humanity away from me. I talk to 10, 20 niggas a day. And then motherfuckers be like, oh, shout the drunk. Nah, nigga, I'm tired. Nigga, I'm making beats. Nigga, I work at night. Nigga, I, I shit. From the time I started making beats, nigga, I'm, I'm going to 10 o'clock in the morning. That's why I hate when people say, oh, this nigga's still up, this nigga's still online. You know what I'm saying? I be doing that shit for people that I know this over here that probably just woke up. They want to see y'all the red on live making a beat or just shooting the shit with them or conversating with them. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I'm not finna, you know, and that's why, like, I was telling my girl the other day, I said, man, I done went through so much shit. I'm surprised I'm still here. Like, even with me cutting my wrist. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit was just like, that shit was like a real accident, bro. And then you see Lil Uzi say the same shit I said, but motherfucker thinking I'm crazy. He said the same, he was cutting a rip tie and stab himself in the lip. He just said, it. so like everybody, like from the time I even woke up today, everybody like, you know the shit, it just happened to you. So then when you get your brother, you get your, your loved one tell, asking your lawyer, did you intentionally cut your hand after you done said, I was cutting a rip tie? You get what I'm saying? That fucked up. Like, I'm sorry, Red, nigga, I got to make beats, bro. I got to use both of my hands. I play. I'm not a mouse nigga. You think this shit don't fuck with me? When I seen that shit, why would I intentionally cut my fucking hands, nigga? I love my life, bro. Like, I'm not suicidal or, or none of that shit, nigga. That's how I felt the nigga try to play me. Like, I'm suicidal and shit. But that's how them nigga train them, nigga, man. That fame, you know what I'm saying? If fame make you scared of your own family, could keep that shit. You know what I'm saying? Keep that shit. Cause that's what I see. I see niggas scared of their own family. Nigga, I've been around you several times. I wouldn't hurt you, nigga. I wouldn't hurt you. Point blank period. That's the really thing I can tell you. I done been in the room and I could have hurt the nigga my goddamn so Real talk. You know what I'm saying? Nah, that's facts. That's facts. That ain't no cap. We don't we done been in the room several times to get a buy goddamn self. I wanna hurt that nigga. If I felt ill will or if I, if I was jealous or any type of shit, I done been in the room with this nigga seven times, bro. Like, I love it. That's my brother. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, I'm not going to let this nigga 
I don't give a fuck how many more times this nigga transition with his business team. I don't, the nigga ain't finna keep jumping me off. And his business team ain't finna keep jumping me off. I don't give a fuck what nobody say. The motherfucker be little to me like I didn't contribute to nothing. That's how they talk to me. They talk, they, they talk to me like I didn't build the shit with the nigga. They talk to me like I'm just, you know what I'm saying? They be like, well, you know, he's he doing this and he's doing that. We, we cool with what you did for him, but boom, 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 boom. You know what I'm saying? But he's he's on the other things. Okay. That's cool. That's fine. And then, well, shit, we don't going to be paid. <laughs> I give a fuck about all that. We don't going to be paid, though. I, I don't give a fuck. I don't want no cars to endorse me. I don't want to be around me. You know what I'm saying? If that the case, I would be the shit. That's the whole thing. Like, nigga, nigga be trying to try me like I want to be around this nigga. I don't want to be around this nigga. I was around that nigga. That shit didn't bring me nothing but bullshit and pain. I was around that nigga. I don't want to be around that nigga. Shit. That's the really shit I want my motherfucking money. I don't want to be around that nigga. I don't know what that nigga got going on, but I ain't finna be the sacrifice. I tell you that much. <laughs> I ain't finna be the sacrifice. Yeah. Me watching the goddamn um me watching the Tyson fight and just seeing like the celebrity part and shit. Like I'm so mad at goddamn I'm so mad at Jesus to the point like like that nigga know how I fight. He he the pistol play nigga. That's the whole he he know how I fight. Like I don't back down from no fight. So I'm just watching the Mike Tyson shit. And, the celebrity shit. I was just like, you know what? I was saying with my girl, and I was just telling my boss, I just really want to fight this man. Big bro, little bro fight. So when we watched the fight the other day, I said, that would probably be, we could do it for Chad. You feel me? Because he been boxing. See, my uncles, you know, I got I got a little Mexican in me, come. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Yuma, Arizona. Y'all know what I'm talking about. He did Red Cherokee Indian. He did. So I used to box. My uncles tell me how to box. Like, so I'm always fighting. Jesus tell me, man, you can't fight these niggas. Everybody tell me to keep my hand in my pocket. Okay, cool. But that one I'm on, I'm on, I'm on some shit like that. If a nigga feel the same type of way, I say next year around this time, I say me and he'll need to be the celebrity. I think me and him need to be the uh celebrity boxing man. You feel me? Cause I had fear. I just want to embarrass that nigga real quick. 
You know what I'm saying? Just on some, okay. We know you can get the goons. I can get the goons too. Let's leave the goons out of Let's leave the goons out of because it's going to be a problem. And you know that. That's why he's saying nothing. He ain't saying nothing. But he's been training the last couple of years. He's been boxing because, you know, he tried to imitate what everybody do. You know, because, you know, he friends with Jay-Z. But you ain't finna dang dash me, nigga. Fuck that. So he be in but he be boxing this shit, but you know, at the end of the day. At the end of the day, I say let's do it. Let's do that. Let's set it up. Y'all gonna record something. Since man don't wanna talk to me, he feel like I'm out here putting lies out and trying to assassinate the character and shit. You know, I'm willing for the big bro, little bro fight. Let's do it. Let's do it for Chad. You did. Let's do it. Since he black power me. You black power me, but you ain't paid your A1 yet. You ain't paid your A1 yet. You feel me? So, you know, that's what I'm on. Because the Tyson shit gonna be big. You feel me? They gonna do celebrity shit. Let's do it. Let's do it. I say next year around this time, it should be Red versus snow. Oh, we, oh, we can do it soon. We can do it soon or somewhere. But that's how I feel. That's how I feel. That's how I feel. So at the end of the day, see, I don't put it out there. All I need time to train. That's it. I would love, I would love to punch Jesus in his face a couple of times. Then, big bro, little bro fight. I would love, I would love that. He don't got too, he don't got too big for his britches. He don't forget who his real people is. Nigga need a reality check. All right, y'all, y'all laugh. All right. Yeah, he blocking anybody. He he blocking anybody that, that don't at me on his page. He blocking he blocking anybody that at me on his page. So don't even you know what I'm saying. That tell you how much you feel me. I'm just telling you, like, bro, like, y'all think I would be sitting up here? When have y'all know me? When have I never? When have y'all caught me in the lab, bro? Like, you get what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. I, I wouldn't even be talking about this shit. You get what I'm saying? Come on, man. I've been quiet. I've been quiet. I still ain't been paid. They get Christmas and shit. I ain't even, it's Christmas and shit. I got paid for surgery and shit. It's like, damn, nigga, nigga ain't. You know what I'm saying? It's cool. It's cool. But and then he ain't sliding with this. I don't give a fuck. I can't Jesus one on one by itself. This is right. I tell you that much. I tell you that much, we're going to fight. Tell him put that 40 down. Because I got mine on me too. Tell him he can put it down. He's going to have to square up. He's going to have to catch the fade. I 
<laughs> Look, everybody laugh. All right. All right. All right. Show me what Sauter Red got his chain to. Show me what Sauter Red got his ass to. I've been in music business since I was 15. Where's the footage, cuz? Where is that? Where is that? Jesus don't get along with nobody. How the fuck on this little bro? Why is that? Now nah, they got this little trick that they do. I always make everybody pay up front. They got this little trick. They send you, they send you a percentage of. They send you a percentage of. Then they charge you for the, the other shit. You feel me? I mean, look, let me tell you something. I was saying, y'all want to hear a story? Y'all want to hear a real story? So y'all y'all wanna hear some funny shit? Y'all wanna so I had I had the versus party over me. I wasn't gonna do it, but my lawyer was like, you should have so I had TMZ here. I had TMZ here. I had a couple of my best friends, like my eight ones. Cause I did, I really didn't want to watch. I had my girl, I had the baby. She the baby didn't the baby didn't know what the fuck was going on. She just she just knows she didn't have no kids around. So she was bored as fuck. So I was focused on her. So soon as the verse came on. I got this anxiety because I wasn't expecting. It. I'm talking about like we was all we was sitting here for like an hour and thirty minutes just waiting. I was seeing the behind the scenes. I, I was seeing the shit that people weren't seeing and shit. I was seeing all this shit and um, the shit kind of fucked with me. Because it fucked me up so bad to the point I couldn't even watch it. I still be nervous talking about it because I fuck with both of them. I love both of them. I love Jesus. I love Gucci. Like them, them my partners. So this shit fucked me up. I'm just saying, I'm just like, man. So soon as Soon and got down Gucci win with that first song I walked out of the room. I, I was down in the tear right. I was like, God damn. <laughs> I walked, I walked right in my booth, bro. Set the fuck down. And I I was just I was just like in this in this in this space, like and I was just like, man, I couldn't even watch this shit. I couldn't even watch it. I couldn't even watch it. You see, I had so I had so much anxiety, bro. I couldn't even watch it. Like anybody would tell you, like if you was here with me, that shit fucked me up. Cause I was like, oh shit, this shit finna be ugly. You know what I'm saying?
I was like, man, you see finna be ugly. And I just felt bad, so I just sat in the booth. I just sat in the booth. I was, I was just like, I just sat in the booth, I didn't even watch it. So like, they just called me out whenever they played a song of mine. Cause I was just fucked up. So then when they called me out, and then Gucci did the truth. They called me out and I was sitting right here. I was amped up. I had bone cushion with me. I had family with me. And then Gucci man did the truth. I was just like, oh, it broke me then. I was like, oh, this is it. I went, I didn't even listen to the to the hoes. I, I walked right in the goddamn. I was fucked up. Cause I just felt bad. I was just like, I don't know what the fuck finna happen. So like, I didn't get to enjoy the verses. Cause it's like, I was sitting there in the booth, fucked up. So I'm like, both of these niggas, my family, they my partner. I didn't know how that shit was going to go. Then I felt bad because I was like, damn, I should have been there with, with G's because they told me that. You feel me? But then I was like, but then at the same time, my people was like, why keep supporting a nigga don't support you? You know what I'm saying? That nigga genuinely love you like you love him. Shit, why you even worry about it? So like everybody just got now, you know what I'm saying? That was the talk. I was just saying. Just saying. Now yeah, no, it ain't anxious. It's anxiety. I got PTSD. Everything how I look. Everything how I look. Especially when it comes to your love. So So like people were mad at me because I even gave a fuck. And I'm just like, this is my character. You know what I'm saying? They were mad that I wasn't enjoying the win like I was supposed to. I should have been enjoying the win because I won. You know what I'm saying? And I wasn't enjoying it because I was worried about my people being safe. You know what I'm saying? So. A lot of people were mad at me that night. And, um, shit. Once I got me some rest and, and just reevaluated, and then it's like, when I seen Jesus say some crazy shit on me, they asked me about me. Shout out Red needs some help. I was like, wow. That was a low blow. So now it made me relapse. So, you know, you just play me like you play the mother nigga. So now I gotta really get in my bag. I gotta check you. I gotta check this nigga. And that's what it is. And my thing is, the other nigga, sideline niggas, snowballs, you gotta better stay out of the week. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. Now I got to check this nigga. Okay? Like, he could have gave me a pocket. He could have said crazy. something highly about me. Because I ain't never shitting on the nigga. I always been 100 with the nigga. And then the nigga tried to downplay me. He tried to downplay me when I'm speaking facts. I can see you I'm not speaking facts. I'm speaking facts, you know? He tried to downplay me. So now he got to deal with me. You feel me? So so, so then again, now it's another slap in the face because it's like, they like, damn, you sitting up there worried about this nigga. This, this nigga gonna do an interview. And soon they ask you, he shit on you. Again. So, so now he got to deal with me. And my thing is, sideline nigga better leave this shit alone. 
That's all I'm saying. Snowball nigga better leave this shit alone. Cause I ain't backing down. I ain't scared. Of, I ain't scared of snowman. And I shouldn't have to deal with snowballs. I made that nigga, I'm gonna break that nigga. It's either he come correct or I'm gonna be on his ass every day. That's all I'm doing. I'm gonna be on that nigga ass every day. I don't give a fuck how much more money y'all got than Charlie Red. I'm gonna be on that nigga ass every fucking chance I get. Period. Cause now you trying to make it seem like it's something else. Instead of speaking the truth. I can tell you that now. I can tell you that now. Niggas on high alert. They know I know where that nigga stay. They on high alert. They waiting for me to pull up. They think I'm going to get me. They know I know where he stay. That's what I'm saying. My issue is broke. The rest of you niggas need to shit in life. I know where you niggas at. I know where all the snowballs are. But one thing about snowballs, they can't sit their ass still. They got to keep rolling, 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 rolling. Because they're trying to figure out how to get bigger. You did? Snowball was always in the street. The difference is, shit. A lot of people don't like snowballs. But a lot of people love Sardar Red. Look, you notice how my shit went up? It's crazy. You know, it was a whole time. I think this is my highest view. 75 people. Wow, that's crazy. When I'm doing the positive shit, I'm doing all the other shit. I don't get none of that. I got like 10 people here, this motherfucker. That I know. Y'all see this shit? Got 75 motherfucking people on this motherfucker. Wow. I had 80. Well, I'll be goddamn. Well, I'll be goddamn. Shit. What they gonna say now? What's the story gonna be? Shout the red Vince on Instagram. What what the story gonna be now? What we gonna do? How they how they gonna uh try to assassinate my character now? What up, Yoshi? How they gonna assassinate my character now? What they gonna try to say now? You feel me? They trying to figure it out. Yeah, I'm cool with that. I called the nigga out the first thing. That's the thing. I called him out. Don't wish me well, nigga. How you gonna wish me well? You owe me. Wish me well. I don't know what Sutter is. Y'all didn't see that shit? Y'all didn't see that shit? Wish me well, man. Oh, y'all didn't see this shit? Hey, how I do the uh, 
how I put the video up, how I do the video shit. You seen that shit? He don't know. I don't know what's up with Sergeant Red. I wish bro well though. How, how I do that shit? How I put the shit on the screen. He can't say nothing. He, he fucked up after that. He fucked up. He fucked up after that. Y'all see it. All right. Me and Jesus done. I don't give a fuck. So all you do boy nigga, snowball nigga. Me and that nigga done. I don't give a fuck what he say after me. I don't give a fuck. I put that on my grandma. I'm trying to pull it up. Oh, oh, my arm. Oh, that nigga my said this shit. Nigga, you should. The fuck? Oh, you talk about oh, I intentionally oh, cut oh, myself. Oh. Then you go out there and talk about something wrong. You shot a red like Nigga try to see him. Make it seem like. Like. Something mentally wrong with me. When all I want is my fucking money. Like this ain't been a pattern. They did me like that with Trapper Die 3, nigga. You feel me? Why you think you never see me with Trapper Die 3? And we put to be, we only came together for because Bankroll Fresh died. So me, D Rich, and Jesus only came together because we wanted to do that shit for D Rich. Because we were passing the torch to D Rich. And bank roll fresh. Did me the same way then. Y'all ain't see me. When have y'all seen me and Jesus together? When? When? It's, tell me when y'all seen me and Jesus together. Where that shit at, bro? I'm trying to put that shit on my shit. Oh, he fucked up, man. Did he? There ain't nothing else to say, did he? I'm on that nigga head. Did he? Where that shit at, bro? I don't know. He might come back live, y'all. We're going to see what he do, man. Um. Okay. I don't know where that is. Ooh. I think I could just jump in the water. Y'all find that shit. Yeah, I that's what I'm saying. And where I find this shit at, too. How you play the video shit? Now that nigga said something like. I got the shit, it's just like, it ain't let me go to the. Um, You saw it. Y'all know what I'm Daddy. Daddy. Hey, I just found it right there. Oh, man, you found it. I found it. It's right in front of me. Okay, let's take it back at the front. Let me just pick it up, okay? 
do is go find it. that I can't talk to every day. So like when I'm up, I'll be trying to get in and, and just, you know what I'm saying? It's hard to explain. It's hard to explain. It's like you be more than no. like fresh ears. You know what no. I'm saying? Fresh ears. So I get on live and I shoot the shit with people and I just have fun. And people be mad at that. Like I shouldn't be doing that shit. Or I shouldn't be, you know, you bigger than that. Uh, you know what I'm saying, but you can't tell me how I, I won if it ain't broke, don't fix it. I won because I was a people person. You know what I'm saying? Just think, if I wasn't a people person, then see most of the motherfuckers that I produce wouldn't even be out right now. We wouldn't even be having these conversations. Daddy! So now all I'm trying to do is just like figure out what the young nigga, you know, cause the young niggas feel like Charlotte Red don't fuck with them. You know, like even from the producer, like I don't like the South Side feel like I don't fuck with them. I don't like that that Zaytoven feel like I don't fuck with. Them. I don't like that Mike Will feel like I don't fuck with them. I don't like that. I don't, you know what I'm saying? Like I was the young, I was the first young nigga. After Jermaine Dupree, but I did it for us. You know what I'm saying? So I don't understand, you know, why they think of me like that when all it is like shit. I Maybe mean, you want to pull up on me, I'll let you pull up on me. You might have just been talking to the wrong person. You know what I'm saying? So you can't be, you know what I'm saying? If you can talk to me good, just, just talk to me. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody else gonna pull up on me. You know what I'm saying? But then again, it's like as a man, you gotta sit back and be like, them nigga don't wanna talk to you because the simple fact they sound like you. You know what I'm saying? I don't sound like 808 Mafia. I don't sound like a Zito. I sound like Charlotte Red. So, you know, you know that when you say them type of things, like that's not reality to them nigga. So they be mad about that shit. Them niggas sound like me. I don't sound like them. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? So they might be feeling some type of weight. You know, but they ain't big to how you, you know what I'm saying? I'm a man. Like, I ain't finna let nobody see here. You know, that's like, that's like, that's like I let you, I let you come in my house, nigga. You know what I'm saying? And you, and you, you allow you to fuck my bitch. You get what I'm saying? Nah, nigga, you can come in my house all day, but, but you ain't finna be in my room fucking my bitch. You know what I'm saying? Hell no. Nah. And laughing in my face. Now you can fuck my bitch outside, but not in my bed. You see, that's the difference. You feel me? That's the difference. You feel me? But not in my bed. You ain't gonna fuck my bitch in my dick. Now that's disrespectful. Now that's disrespectful. You got a little boy. Look at this clicking. All right, so here you go right here. So I just pulled it up. So here you go right here. This is one we this is like right out of the verses. So, Shorty Red was just such a uh, 
he was he was a staple in the, in the early part of your career. I, I know the two of you had some differences. Right. I've never see how uh, I have things out because I, I just recently saw him on the brand saying I'll um, use my songs and verses. Well, right. I'll never be able to work things out and come back together again. I mean, I just wish him the best, bro. I mean, if I'm honest, I mean, I really think, you know, he needs, you know, he needs help. Like, it's, it's, it's bigger than that. You know what I'm saying? You know, I'm going to my brother, but, you know, I, I don't know who you talking about, but you just can't have the truth to it. But um, I think it's bigger than that. It's bigger than that. You know what I'm saying? You know, my question, you got a brother. You, you feel like we're a boy, you got to figure it out. But I personally think yeah, my brother needs help. You know what I'm saying? If I'm honest. Yeah. Yeah. Shorty Ray was just such a uh he was he was a staple in the in the early part of your We're gonna play that one more time. I know the two of you had some differences. Right. I've mean, never see um uh, I have things out because I, I just recently saw him on the brand saying i will use my songs and verses. Well right. I'll never be able to work things out and come back together again. I mean, I just wish him the best, bro. I mean, if I'm honest, I mean, I really think, you know, he needs, you know, he needs help. Like, he, it's, it's, it's bigger than that. You know what I'm saying? You know, I'm going my brother, but, you know, I, I don't know what you talking about, but you just can't have the truth to it. But um, I think it's bigger than that. It's bigger than that. You know what I'm saying? You know, my question, you got a brother. You, you fell out with before, and I got to figure it out. But I personally think yeah, my brother needs help. You know what I'm saying? If I'm honest. Yeah. yeah. So so my thing is then on top of that, then on top of that, like it's that one little clip that's out there. You get what I'm saying? Like why would you put that one little clip out there? Like you get what I'm saying? That's fire to me. That's fire to me. Like it's that one little clip out there on YouTube. Like everybody, like I don't be on that shit. My little homies tell me that shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? I ain't. I'm. I'm social media. Like if I knew how to win on social media, see it. Live would be booming like a motherfucker. Real talk. You feel me? Cause you know I just wanna have fun and just fuck around and just make my beats and just shoot the shit with people. You know what I'm saying? If y'all, you know. If y'all ain't got that yet, but that's that's after that, bro. It's it's I'm mad as fuck. So after that, it's like you trying to make it, nigga. You owe me money, bro. You trying to make it seem like something wrong with me. That's crazy. That's that's crazy as fuck. That's crazy as fuck. Y'all want to see something crazy, though? Since he say he don't know. Now, mind you, he get permission for everything, right? Y'all want to see something crazy as fuck? <clears throat> now, I'm going to say that. I was finna go in. I was finna go in. But I don't like that. I don't like that, bro. We put to be brothers, man. You ain't got nobody, ain't nobody around this nigga a one d one but me. And the nigga treat me like that. That's crazy. That's crazy as fuck to me. That's crazy as fuck to me. I don't understand that. And it's like, nigga, I ain't asking you for no handout. Nigga, I come, I, I came and did the work, bro. I ain't come to say, hey, nigga, pay me this. Let me get this. I came and did the work, bro. You put the music out. If it be Christmas, I done did this work for you from the beginning of the year. Now I can't even it, it, uh, reap the repercussions of my work because you motherfuckers ain't paid me yet. You get what I'm saying? I can't even provide for those that I need to provide for. You know what I'm saying? And she fucked up.
Bro, you think I have it? Okay. What we talk? What we talk? Well, do I got Duval on the somewhere, I think. No, I think we did that after all of this.
Matter of fact, why would I even call DJ Paul in for a mixtape? Like, think about it. DJ Paul don't do no fucking mixtape. Please understand, due to the COVID situation, I have not been allowed in the studio. It will be to finish my list. Currently, I have more records with other producers. Jeezy and I could laugh did before studio was shut down. Those songs and sessions I do not have with me at this time. 